Hi, dear friends. It's Devor here, live from inside my home in Jerusalem. Um, so it, it has been a little challenging, a little a lot, as a single mom to be with my kids all the time and um, for them to be with each other all the time. Um, and really, I don't have anything besides for my soup to share with you. I want to share with you my uh, my soup, how I make it. Um, it's delicious. It's amazing. I don't have much to share in terms of like chizuk or anything like that, besides for the fact that doing what we're meant to be doing right now, which is what Hashem wants us to do, which is to stay indoors. Um, there's not much else that we can possibly be doing under the circumstances. We can be davening, and we can be saying to him. We could be watching things online, learning things, um, playing with our kids. But I think the most important thing to keep in like the forefront of our minds is to be relaxed and to be happy and to be calm. And whatever that entails, just do it. Um, when I mean just do it, I mean like, you know, if right now you had in mind to go through all the closets and to kosher the fridge and to you know go through the books and decide which ones you want to want and which ones you want to give away and things are getting in the middle of that and your kids are fighting or things are happening around then just let it go you'll do it tomorrow you'll do it the next day the most important thing is to just stay calm calm because when the stress levels are high in our bodies then our immune system is compromised and also like we're, there's there, literally it's one long day that's what it feels like to me anyway so it feels like one long day so now we are up to lunch don't ask me what my kids have for breakfast today I don't know what they had for breakfast yesterday and the, all the days before I really knew what they had for breakfast and I made them healthy breakfast today I was all, all I was able to do was make them a freshly squeezed orange juice which is what we do every day we squeeze oranges for our vitamin C and um Right now, I want to show you this, this soup that I make. My friend brought me over this soup like a few weeks ago and I wasn't feeling well. And I was like, OMG, what a soup is this? This is an amazing, amazing soup. So I'll show you what's in it. I just made it and I still have to judge it, put it in the blender. If you have a zhuzhar, great. If you don't, put it in the blender. It's an amazing soup. It's called orange soup. This one, I think, is better than any orange soup I've ever tasted. That's the truth. So let me show you what's in it. Right now, bubbling in here is... One and a half uh, butternut squash, five carrots, two sweet potatoes, two sautéed onions, three cloves of garlic, and two raw tomatoes. See, the skin is still sitting there in my thing. Um, you peel, and you throw it in. Then you spice it, and then you put some water in it. Okay, and then you let it cook in there like that, like you just saw. And then you put some spices in it, salt, pepper. Um, and then you put it into your blender. And it's amazing. It comes out so, so good. Really, the original recipe also calls for two or three regular potatoes. But I don't, I try not to do regular potatoes. I try. And, um, yeah, that's the story. I'm grateful. Today, I am grateful to God for giving me the motivation and the actual, like, push, the wherewithal, to get out of my house and go jogging. And that's what I did. I went running today. And it felt really, really good. The streets were completely empty, literally empty. I literally saw maybe a few cats and two people, empty. And I ran all around my area here. But I'm very, very grateful that I was able to run and get out of that mindset a little bit. Some days are better than others. Some days are easier than others. Um, we just have to learn to ride the wave. Uh, learn to ride the wave whatever it is whatever situation you feel like you know you're in right now just don't stress that's the most important thing just try to get yourself not to stress go take a bath go take a walk go in for a nap watch something just say to Helen do something that doesn't stress you out just stay like mm, like zen just stay zen as much as possible let this wave just go by and with not a lot of you know stress and pain and heartache and all of that put our put our focus and our energy into what matters into being happy into getting Yom Tov ready into um, spending time with our kids 
um, spending time with ourselves, writing down things that we want to accomplish with our life, with our time eventually, um, and just being kind, being kind to yourself, being kind to the people around you. And don't worry, if you're so used to being a human doing, and if right now is expected from us to be a human being, don't worry, the rest, of, the rest of the world is right there behind you. I don't think any of us really know how to do this human being thing very well. But we're learning on the job. In any case, I'm going to take a picture and I'll show you my soup after it's done. Feel good, everyone. Fuerzaimata al-Dukhulam.